and welcome to News Channel 9 at noon on this Election Day 2020. I'm Dan Cummings. Good to see you. And from your local election headquarters today, we know that more than 2 million New Yorkers have already cast their ballots. But since the polls opened this morning on Election Day itself at 6 a.m., central New Yorkers are continuing to exercise their right to vote in huge numbers. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc joins us live now from one of the more than 150 polling places throughout Onondaga County. Julia, good afternoon. Are you seeing that big turnout where you've been? Good afternoon, Dan. We sure are here at Nottingham High School. I'm told they've had at least 320 voters so far and counting as people are still trickling in. I'm told also as soon as the polls opened here at Nottingham, they did have a line that wrapped around the building in the early morning. But these people are still coming in. And this is exactly what we were kind of expecting as we've seen record numbers of voters, absentee ballots, and even registrations over the last couple of weeks. So for those who haven't cast their ballot yet, though, here's a few reminders. If you haven't made it out to the polls yet. Make sure you know where your polling site is. If you have a question, you can call your local Board of Elections office. You have to wear a mask, and if you don't have one, there will be some at your polling place. They told me, do not bring your own pen. They will wipe down the pens and polling pads in between each voter. And when it comes to those results, well, we're going to have to be patient. We will know those early voting totals, but we have to wait for the absentee ballots to be counted. They don't even open those until Monday. Like around 9 15, 9 30 p.m., we'll start posting the early voting results. The election night results will start physically being driven into our offices to be posted on our website around 10 p.m. The absentee results, so the 53,000 people who voted by absentee, we can't even start counting that to November 9th. We have to have certification done to the state by November 28th. So we're going to do our best to try to count 10,000 ballots a day starting November 9th. Now, a final reminder to voters, the polls are closing tonight at 9 o'clock, so you do still have some time. If you have an absentee ballot, you can hand it in at any of those polling sites or your local board of elections through that time until 9 o'clock tonight as well. And then, of course, um, just make sure that you head out there, exercise your right to vote. We have seen record numbers, and we do expect those numbers to continue to grow until 9 o'clock tonight. And if you're mailing that absentee ballot, make sure it's postmarked by today. Live at Nottingham High School, Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9.